So hi guys, this is Gavin from Enfield Radar. Hope you guys are doing an amazing job out there. So as the title of the video suggests, today's video is going to be 5 things I love about my motorcycle. So hope you guys enjoy the video. Thank you. So guys, this video was actually a task given by Prajesh from Bullet Diaries. As you guys all know, Prajesh from Bullet Diaries is the number one bullet motor vlogger in India. So Please do check out his channel, he just makes one of the most informative videos regarding bullet. So I'll be uh, placing a, a what? I'll be placing a link in the description below. Do check out his channel. You it will be totally worth it. So actually coming into the topic of the video, today I'll be sharing with you guys five main points that I totally adore about my motorcycle so the first point that I need to share with you guys is the comfort the bullet actually gives so as some of you guys might know I actually owned a Yamaha RN5 two years back so coming from that motorcycle this was just like heaven for me guys the seating position the comfort the seats gave the riding posture everything was just super 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 amazing for me as you guys all know, Yamaha RN5s, it's just uh, totally committed into a sports riding position. So coming from that into a touring perspective, I just totally adored or totally was so damn amazed at the seating positions and the comfort the bullet actually gave me. So that, that is the first point that I totally like about my motorcycle. The second point that I want to share with you guys that I love about my motorcycle is actually the sheer amount of torque the vehicle gives at every single gear. This was actually a concern for me when I owned my Yamaha RN5. There was a lot, a lot of situations where there was a lot of situations where I was held at traffic and I had to make a lot of gear changes just to keep up with the traffic. But once I owned the uh, Bullet uh, 500. This was never an issue for me again. The linear power delivery of the vehicle allows me to cruise at speeds of 50 to 60 kilometers even at the fifth gear without even a need to change or uh, down the gears. So that was actually a surprise for me when I started to ride this motorcycle. So that's the second point that I love about my motorcycle. So the third point that I love about my motorcycle is the actually the fuel economic the vehicle gives before i even owned the bullet 500 there was a lot of mis misleading concepts saying that i won't even get a fuel economy of more than 25 kilometers per liter but i was super damn surprised once i started riding the vehicle that i got or uh, i'm getting a fuel economy of more than 32 to 35 kilometers per liter so uh, even the fuel injected classic 500 won't even give you more than 25 to 28 kilo kilometers per liter. So, can, can you even imagine a 500cc uh, vehicle giving you a mileage of 35 kilometers? I can't. So, that turns out to be the third point that I love about my motorcycle. The fourth point that I love about my motorcycle is actually the size of the tire this particular model comes with. So. Generalizing the bullet as a vehicle, there are mainly three models. It's the bullet 500, the bullet 350, standard 350, as well as the bullet Electra. So comparing these three models in particular, we will see that this model only comes with a fat tire, both at the rear and the front. So as I have written all the three models, I, I can make sure that this model or this bullet 500 uh, tire gives you much more stability while cornering at a higher speed as well as at uh, wet conditions like and uh, at monsoon seasons and all this gives you much more grip due to the MR of tires so this leads me to the fourth point that I love about my motorcycle so the fifth and final point that I want to share with you guys that I love about my motorcycle is bullet as a brand Personally speaking, my great-grandfather, he owned a bullet in the 1950s. My grandfather, he owned one. My father, he owned one. And so on. As the generations passed by, I got the privilege to own one, personally. So, jokes apart, I want to 
convey a message that there is a lot of misleading conceptions regarding Bullet as a brand, their quality and so on. I just want to say that more than 70% of the Bullets that are owned nowadays are owned by youngsters. And youngsters means there are a lot of situations where I have seen youngsters drive Bullets at a speed of more than 120 to 130 kilometers. Bullet is not a vehicle to be driven at such speeds. Give the respect it deserves guys. I'm not trying to criticize anyone. But in general, compared to the older generations who own the bullet, we youngsters don't actually care that much about how the bullet is meant to be ridden, its sole purpose and so on. So, it's, so I would highly suggest before we try to raise our voices against bullet as a brand, every single time I get up on this machine, I feel like an emotional message passing by. It feels like we are part of this history. It's not just like a bike guys, it's a machine. Take care of it, respect it, and it will bring joy to your lives. Hope you guys like the video. If you do so, please do subscribe and stay tuned for much more. Once again, please, please love your machine, respect it. Thank you guys.